Okay, in this screencast, we're going to go over how to turn on notifications and customize them to your own needs. Now, notifications are uh, just basically email alerts or mobile uh, phone alerts that tell you that something has happened on the Schoology site. All right, so let's start off. Uh, just go ahead and log in. And once you've logged in, in the upper right-hand corner, you'll see your name. And right next to it, you'll see a little down arrow. So click on the down arrow and you'll see a tab that says notifications. Don't worry about the rest of those, like account settings or privacy or anything like that for right now. Let's just look at notifications. And when you turn on notifications, this is what pops up. Again, don't worry about these other tabs over here, but let's just look at these. And you can customize what kinds of emails, uh, what kind of information will come to you okay and you'll notice that they come from four different sources the first source is from any academic source so for example courses that you might belong to or that your uh, son or daughter might belong to if you're a parent that sort of thing and it, you can actually have alerts sent to you or notifications sent to you either by email or by mobile or by both by both okay if you want all of these types of comments to come to you turn them all on okay uh, just be warned though that sometimes your mailbox for example could be flooding with any kind of course update that occurs all right if you're a student especially the other three areas where you can receive notifications are from any group that you belong to okay and again these are the types of notifications that you would get again turn them on or turn them off I'm just leaving them all off here because that's a default setting you have to set them whatever you want to do uh, the school one's probably an important one so whenever the school makes a an update for example like you know we're having a uh, uh, day of free dress you know and that might set that as an update you might want a notification on that somehow if you're a student for example or that you know we're gonna cut class short for whatever reason again if you're a parent you might want to turn on either your mobile or your email notification and then finally the personal ones and these are a little bit rarer okay uh, these are for like people who have I don't know personal communications with like a teacher if you're a parent or a student or you have your own group and you want just one-on-ones -on -ones and that sort of thing and then make sure you hit the save the changes and then you are pretty much done okay so again real briefly right next to your name right hand arrow hit notifications and then once you've done that customize turn them on and off depending on what kind of notification you would like okay I hope that was helpful